I will be using these two boards that I picked up from my job. I will be using this silver metallic spray paint that I purchased from Home Depot. I will only be spray painting the edges. I will be using the two boards that I already spray painted and let dry. E6000 glue, Gorilla glue, glue sticks, of course the glue gun, these drawer knobs that I purchased from Amazon, and these mirror tiles that I purchased from eFavorite Mart. Everything that I used in this video will be listed down in the description box. As you can see, I left a little space on the edge of the board. I previously laid out my mirror tiles and my mirror tiles did not fully cover the board. So I will be leaving a space here just so it can be even on both sides. As you can see here, I'm only using the Gorilla Glue. I stopped using the hot glue gun because I found that once I mixed the hot glue with the Gorilla Glue, the mirror tiles was just too slippery. They were sliding all over the place. So that's why I'm now I am only using Gorilla Glue. Here I'm only using this clear tape to keep my mirror tiles in place because this is the only tape I had at the time. Okay, as you can see, I did go a little too OD with the Gorilla Glue. So when I place the heavy item on top of the mirror tiles, you can see that the glue did seep out from all the cracks and the edges. It's just a whole mess. But um, I do have an X-Acto knife and I will be using that to cut all the glue off, the excess glue off. Um, you just gotta be really careful with this part because these mirror tiles are glass and you can damage them but just be real careful and um, take your time it is time consuming but it did work
If you're wondering why am I cleaning off my mirror tiles now and I still have tape and the excess glue on my mirror tiles, I'm only cleaning it off now because I had found out that it was better to go along and just use the acetone because it made it easier for me to get the glue off and also the residue that was left over from the tape. I removed all the excess glue and the residue from the tape. Now I will be using this E6000 glue to glue my drawer knobs onto the mirror towels. Okay, once the drawer knobs dried, I removed the glue strings, but as you can see here, all along the edges, you can see the Gorilla Glue. So what I will be doing is, I will be using this silver glitter tape that I purchased from my local Dollar General store. I already cut small pieces. I cut them this small because hot glue dries really fast and that's what I will be using to cover up the edges. I use sawtooth hangers that I purchased from Home Depot to hang my wall decor and I think these turned out absolutely beautiful. I will be showing a couple ideas on what these glam racks can be used for so just keep on watching. This can also be used for purses, keys, towels, and whatever you desire. Don't forget to like and comment down below what you will use these for and be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss my next video. Thanks for watching.